guys, we are on a beautiful deck at the Sea Cat restaurant. This is where all the action happens, but we're going to go inside now to see what the chef is cooking. Welcome to Sea Cat, man. Thanks, my guy. Listen, tell me what you have on the menu. And we have breadfruit chips, cassava chips, sweet potato chips, mm -hmm. regular chips. We have that with mahi mahi, barracuda, or tuna. Nice, nice. So, what's, what's your favorite dish to prepare, or what's the most ordered dish that the clients um, request? Well, my favorite dish is the tuna, but the mahi mahi is the seller. I know that you have some clients that are waiting on you and you have to push that forward. So I really would love to see, you know, how you get a meal prepared for them. Is that okay? Yeah, sure. Guys, we are here with Andrew, the owner of Seacat. Thanks for having me, man. Pleasure. Good. Oh, yeah. So, I've seen some really beautiful cuts of fish. Tell me, where do you source your fish? My fish comes from different parts of the island at different times, but 90% um, of my fish comes out of the Bridgetown Fishing Complex. Yes. And I've uh, been operating out of there, uh, providing seafood for many of the restaurants in Barbados for over 15 years. Yes. Okay. Um, daily I source fresh fish, a variety of fish, and I have I noticed that a lot of other restaurants in Barbados tend to be quite complacent with um, the same old, same old. Yes. Dolphin, kingfish, uh, wind snappers here, you know, and a few others flying fish. Yes. But in general, I find that lots of chefs seem either reluctant or unwilling to use a variety of local fish, which yes. we have yes. readily available. Yes. There's only a few places where you go and you can get breadfruit chips or cassava, and you know, sometimes it's this day. It's, but nowhere really does that on a regular basis. Yes. And why not? You have to ask that question. It's true. We have the, we have the product. We have the supply year round. Yes. Red fruits give away in this island. You know, you could feed the island on bread. But yet, few people use it. What is the aim or what do you have to say to all those people watching Bim Rock about the Sea Cat tonight before we sign off? I think that our reputation has been developed through having the availability of uh, regular availability of different types of local fish. Yes. So we hope that um, for you guys that are going to be watching and for anyone that's going to come to the Sea Cat, we look forward to serving you and we, uh, we trust that you will really have a, a good time here. and. When you leave, you'll still have a few dollars in your pocket. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we look forward to seeing all of you here at some point in time. Well, Andrew, thank you for allowing me to come to your place, my guy. Yeah, bless. Respect. Yeah. <laughs>